Welcome back everybody to Funky the Star TV. Gunmen kill police inspector constable in Imo State. So gunmen see the Imo State. I now understand. So now we see Imo State they not get anybody when they represent them. If those gunmen they see they operate. Uh, the one when AK they come and they tell us see uh, one thing happened to IPOB, one thing happened to IPOB. IPOB do this, IPOB, we don't tell them, we don't debunk them. IPOB is a legitimate and peaceful organization. Not be them they cause all this, thing. not be them be the government in the southeastern part of Nigeria. The politicians, Okolocha, Ozodema, Uche Ngosu, uh, Meke Hedioha, all of them. No waiting they happen in the most state. Their hands, they inside the matter. Now them very people when bring you the unknown government if they live in emo states. So especially hope who's other job. Okay, one community where they call a uh, Akokwa community in Idia to North Council area of Emo State. Hmm? And they tell us they don't throw them into Panic as gunmen come attack and come kill some AK people. A police inspector and a constable. In the night, ladies and gentlemen, in the night, now him they attack the divisional police headquarters. Come kill this. Maybe that they look for AK 47, they look for uh, money when AK people don't collect from innocent Biafran people. Only God know what in this government they look for inside the a police station. Or maybe they come a uh, revenge. Because, you know, AK, where they don't knock all these people, they will come and tell us in IPOB. But not be IPOB people. You know, so maybe those people come revenge. Main people, the news say the government people, they over 10. Over 10 of them and then enter that divisional. Police headquarters upon the blast, blast, gone like say tomorrow. Not day. But AK people, when the um, government hand not touch, they cross camper, enter one place. Like, willy willy, it can't be like say they disappear on air. Hmm? Because no monster, when the APC and PDP, Okorocha, who puts on them, all of them bring together. Eh? All of them bring this thing together to deal with the Biafran people. So if you be okay you in Nigeria, or your husband na okay when they knock there, yeah. oh yeah, go meet who puts them on. Ukorocha, Uchi Musu, all of them. Here they are. Now then know what they happen in the most states. Then go we'll tell you what thing happened to your husband. When be inspector when these people knock the way. Okay? Uh -huh. This guy, what they call Saludo, Saludo na governor of uh, <laughs> Anambara State. I don't know whether my side dream in with Peter will be. Uh, see each other or meet each other because that guy na it can't be like uh, Neil when they for Peter will be I that guy not the he no one make Peter will be uh, drink water put cup on top in table if they attack Peter will be anyhow when he wants the man they attack Peter will be anyhow when he wants and two of them come from the same place. The man don't claim say the Peter of since when in tell Peter B within tell Peter B. And tell Peter B say his investment when they on a chair or be a friend and say amount to almost zero. Now so he talk. Since when they talk that then they claim now say they don't attack a family. They are obedient people. You don't know say because they can't be like a Hitler people. Uh -huh. Make we read the headline. May not be like say they make things up ladies and gentlemen. This is Hitler in the making. Saludo on how obedient allegedly at 
Tak Descendant Voices If a politician they don't want you, then go use their mouth to crush you. That's what then they do. And the things where they do, now they tell you, see, now you they do hmm? uh -huh. Salute do not like Peter Obi. Only him know the reason why not take like Peter Obi. Maybe because Peter, you know, everybody now, they sing Peter, Peter, Peter. He got jealous. Just the same thing when they do turn on the camera. You know, jealousy can cause a lot of things. Envyness can cause a lot of things. So just the same thing when they do to number canon. But all of them now they feel the fire. All of them will attack number canon one after the other. Anywhere well on them, they, they know how the thing they do them. They know how the thing they do them after they don't attack number canon. <laughs> we are coming to what thing happen in the court today about number camera. We are coming there. Huh? Mm -hmm. So salute the one total destruction of Peter will be an obedient people. You know, like Peter, you know, once see Peter as president, he's working against Peter, he's working for PDP and APC. So that's it. Maybe Balatunbu don't call and one corner give him Ghana must go. You see? Mm, that is why. Remember, there is nothing money cannot do for these people. Only them like money. We won't be Nigerian people. We don't like money. Now, only them like money. That is why they want to sell your refinery. That is why then they loot you up and down. That is why they don't empty your treasury. You know. So, the saludo is a big problem to Peter. Obi. The man now they claim see Peter will be people say then they insult everyone when come across them, including Christians and Muslim, anybody when they see that attack, according to the guy, which is a lie. Not be true, ladies and gentlemen. Not be true. Now hatred, now hatred, now he make saludo. Hmm? They do all these things to Peter Obi. Atiku advises Buhari to probe $760,000 allegation against Bola Tunubu before joining campaign. Now that's what they tell us now. Before joining campaign, ladies and gentlemen. Before Tunubu joined cam the campaign now of APC. Say, he don't declare. Before he say, he don't declare. The news now they tell us today say, Atiku Abubakar team. Don't tell Buhari to probe. Bola made Tunubu $460,000 when the American FBI take from his account. When they take to see Bola made Tunubu na drug dealer and a money launderer. But today, they, they call the debunk and they tell you now, see, it don't happen, it don't happen. But I think now they tell you, see, before, this, before they even begin to talk about this election, they don't meet Buhari many, many times. Even them, a good luck, Jonathan. All of them know this matter. Everybody know the matter. So, I think I'm going to tell you now, say, you don't, you don't go one boy. You tell and say, probe, boy, I'm going to That is, this one, now, I think they reveal today. Now, the second thing, now, we don't see where they don't The protection, illegal protection, where they give, boy, I'm going to They are protecting, boy, I'm going Illegally, after, boy, I'm going to don't embezzle, Consume, collect, loot, destroy things. In fact, including selling or dealing with drugs. It tell me any Nigerian man when they go talk say you deal on drugs and catch you say you deal on drugs with with confirmed documents. When they go allow you just go like that. They don't allow you go, but Nubu will go scot free. Easy. Easy scot free. Now only the poor people then they prove. If you don't get connection like them, you are gone. In fact, people self will not even do bad like in the canon, then they, they suffer. A lot of innocent Nigerian people they inside prison, no crime at all. Then they suffer. But the people 
the main people when they commit the crimes, when they are top, 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 like Bola Ahmed Tunubu and his group, nothing they happened to them. That is why we don't need APC. That is why we don't need PDP. That is why we don't need anybody coming out from PDP or APC to come and tell us anything. The only thing we need right now, now the liberation of the Biafran people. That is what is at stake now. Because if Bola Meri Tunubu eventually clench, we are in trouble. We are in big trouble. Nigerian people are in big, big, big trouble. President Muhammadu Buhari, according to the news, has been advised to probe the 460,000 for feature allegations against the presidential candidate of the All Progressive Congress, APC Bola Ameritunbu, before joining his campaign bill to flag off in just plateau. That's what they tell us. So that is why this probe of Bola Tunubu, if we are not proban, Nigeria not be Nigeria. Nigeria is a dead country. Because I wonder a whole nation when we allowed a terrorist to come take over their presidency or a nation that we allowed a criminal, a drug dealer, somebody when they cash, when they did drug on drug, ladies and gentlemen, and the money launder like Hush Poppy. That is why they tell us, say, Hush Poppy is more better than all these people. But they love Hush Poppy. We soon expose all of them in a very, very big way that on no feet escape again. Mm -hmm. Because it gets some things when we get, when on no feet take away from us. So, how you want somebody like a drug dealer or somebody when they loot money up and down, when they name now looting, eh, to become your president because all these Bolatunubu crimes have been proven time without numbers everybody knows that before this 20 uh, uh, election now uh, this 2023 election what they call people long time they don't talk see they don't want Bola Tunubu. so how APC Buhari and Aisha Buhari people went on feel Nigerian people will come back on the television they won't impose this same person on us This one now, forcing devil's illusion on us. Why? I not just understand. Una don't feel Una supposed to give chance. APC don't come, they don't feel. One time. One time when they give them chance. They can't take chances. They don't feel. PDP, they don't go sustain years. They don't feel. So they gonna allow new Nigeria. We're gonna allow new people to come take the mantle of power from all these old guys, whether they be drug dealers, terrorists, looters, and fosters. <laughs> One love everybody. <laughs> Don't go vote for Bola Tunubu. You are in trouble. You are in a very, very big. I think Una don't come out again. You don't tell uh, them Buhari. Una Buhari, uh -huh. the Arab man, when they first saw up there, make him probe his friend. His, the man said no, they don't go probe because now he be Jagapa. One love. Don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to thumbs up. Keep on watching. Keep your eye open. Uh -huh. And stay tuned for Funky the Star TV.